Hi, in this video, we will see static class in Java. Okay, what do you mean by static class in Java? In Java, you can have static class as inner class. Just like another static members, nested classes belong with class scope. So the inner static class can be accessed without having an object of outer class. Okay, no need to create an object for the class to access this class. The same way how we did for the static variable, static methods, right? Static inner class cannot access the non-static members of outer class. Okay, non-static members, you cannot access outer class. It can access only static members from the outer class. All right, so how it will be looks like. So Java class, Java static example, I have written in one main method. This class is class data object. Here I have created two things, non-static variable, static variable. So it is the static inner class. This is a static class, static inner class inside that inner non-static variable, inner static variable. Okay. So by taking one example, we'll see everything, how it will be. So I created one class called static class. So inside this, I need to create another class. Okay. So you can create like that class, but it should not be public. So that we will discuss in upcoming videos, public inner class, okay? In the inner class, we have public int non-static variable, okay? And public static int static variable, okay? This is static variable. And inside this, I have a inner class. What is that static? class, static inner class, okay? So the names, whatever you want, you can give int. So I'm just putting another, I'm initializing another variables. What is that inner? non-static variable is equals to 10 int static int int inner static variable is equals to some 50 like this okay what is this static variable inside in a static class, okay? Now, what I'll do here from other class, I want to print something, okay? I want to print something, system dot, out dot, print LA. With the class name only, you can directly access static methods, right? static things, right? So, what is that class? Inner class dot. What and another? What is that static inner class? Inside that static is what inner static variable. So, static inner class dot inner static variable. That's it. Okay this class having static class. If it is static, I can directly use with the help of class name. So class name dot static in there. Inside this, another static is there, this variable. This variable static means directly with the help of class name, I can call it, I did the same thing. Inner class dot static inner dot class dot inner static variable. So if I try to execute this, sorry, I need to get 50, right? You see that I got 50. So classes also I'm getting with the help of class name. Right. So if I try to do this for non-static variable, okay, in the non-static variable. So this is not accessible with the help of class name. If you try to do that, obviously you'll get error. 
what is that non static variable inner non static variable cannot be referred from a static context right so you cannot do this but if you assign some variable to the static variable okay there is nothing right i will assign myself inner class dot static variable is equals to some 25 now if i want to print system dot move dot print ln i can directly print this i'm not going inside this even then also class name dot this is already we have seen but i'm just showing this this is we have seen with other class in our previous videos now it will print what 25 You see that fifty from here, twenty five from here. Okay, but if it is non-static variable, okay, I'll do the same thing. Inner class dot non-static variable. Some forty five something like this. so this is non static non static i cannot access with the help of class name so obviously you will get an error for that i need to create an object right for this i need to create an object so but st static stuff we can directly access using the class name even if it is static class you see that static class dot inside that static stuff i am directly accessing okay this is all about static classes in java okay so what could be the possible interview questions what is static keyword and what is static class can you explain with an example okay so that's all in this video thank you